Hi there, it's uh, Chris from Graphics Direct. I just want to go through the brand new Harder and Steenbeck Ultra, the 2004 uh, new edition. What a great airbrush this is. These have just come in to stock a couple of weeks ago. And I just want to sort of show you what you get when you purchase this from us. So uh, all the features exactly and uh, just a little bit better than a photograph. So uh, as we take the sleeve off here, it comes in the nice Harder and Steenbeck plastic uh, box and in there straight away you just see a detail card of the actual spray pattern that has been done with this airbrush and on the back there there is also a QR code again just so you can look in there for instructions spare parts videos various other bits and pieces so a great little addition that's just a bit of protection for the airbrush so here we go and as you can see a, a beautiful looking airbrush various features on here that make it easier really to start airbrushing uh, and get results pretty much straight away. And it tries to alleviate all the issues that beginners have with an airbrush, um, such as pulling back before pressing down, getting splattering and uh, get achieving a fine line straight away. So as you'll see here, the cup comes separately and this actually is quite a, a large cup here. And this simply pushes in to the top of the airbrush like so. Now, if you wanna use quite a bit of color, obviously you can use the color cup. If you're just doing a little bit of touching up and you just need a small amount, you can just fill the little uh, airbrush there with some paint and you get a few drops in there, which will go a long way when you're, uh, when you're actually spraying. So I'll show you uh, a few of the features here. As you'll know here, there is a, a, a little, five-step system painting system here as you'll notice when you press down on the trigger there and you pull back it goes right the way back now we can twist this round and this is set up for a lot of model makers so you've got a primer uh, you've got base coat settings so each one of these will click into place and only come back so far so you can only pull back the lever and it will only let a certain amount of paint through so uh, it's a great idea so you can get used to how much paint comes out and uh, a great useful tool really. So when it's set to that one there, it will come actually right the way back. You also have the feature so you can see the uh, needle through the uh, air cap at the end here. So you can make sure that's all clean because you will get a little bit of uh, uh, paint tip dry on the end there. And at least you can see it there and give that a clean off and um, be able to carry on spraying. At the back of the airbrush, if we take the barrel off here, they've also added a great feature. So if you want to take the needle out of the airbrush here, they've made it so there's a little sort of cone feature. So when you're putting the needle back in, rather than uh, missing the, the hole and stabbing the, the needle into the uh, airbrush itself, it's easy to slide through. So remember, always slide through, just give a little twist and then tighten up the little screw at the back here. So we'll put that back on the airbrush like so. All Harder and Steenbeck airbrushes, as you know, come with the male quick release fitting. So if you do just have a normal eighth BSP airline, you can just take that off and attach your airline to there. But it is always a, a great idea to have the quick release fitting and use it. We do sell the uh, female quick release fittings for this, which are, uh, are a great piece of kit. So that is the new 2004 Ultra airbrush from Harder and Steenbeck. It comes with a 0.45 millimeter headset, needle nozzle headset. These again are all interchangeable with all the Harder and Steenbeck needles, nozzles and uh, air caps. So uh, a really versatile airbrush at a great price as well. So you can get airbrushing pretty quickly and uh, hone your skills uh, so you can produce some really good work.